Hi all! Thought I'd do a daily run to wind down from doing Darkest Dungeon, which is a shit game and I hate it. Oh, fuck me. What are we here? With Samson? With uh, Dr. Fetus? With Scat Bombs? What is. This is 4th of July shit, innit? So we look like presumably Abraham Watson. Oh, this is great. We have the key piece. We have to beat Megastan. Please let me push this. Which is fine. But what? <laughs> this works extremely well. We have scatter bombs, presumably reminiscent of the fireworks that you foreigners are so well known for when celebrating the fact that this country decided that that country wasn't worth the effort anymore. I suppose we sold it to you as you know, value to you lot because. Oh, this is bad. That's well, quite slow. Um, I don't know if that's just Samson. Have I forgotten? Oh, the wave is going to be very helpful in the future. No, we've got Liberty Camp. Ah, it's dumb. Um, what else? Yeah, it was Samson. Double guessing myself. I suppose we probably sold it to the Americans as a uh, benefit to them. Whereas, in fact, it was just that we were sick of them and didn't want to have to deal with their shit anymore. And now they do fireworks, which is cool with me. It makes, us, it makes for an interesting daily run. We might as well go to the next floor. One quarter minutes. Obviously, we're going to be trying to do... Um, boss Rush. We're going to try and do Hush. But I can't really guarantee either of them, unfortunately. Because, to be quite honest, I don't even think I can guarantee that I get through this entire run in any respect without blowing myself up multiple times uh, <laughs> as a result of Scatterbombs. Although, that's very nice. Having these three bombs all over the place is actually super useful. I mean, don't get me wrong. Being able to explode anything that needs exploding, just like your mama, no bad trip. Addicted is fine, because we're here. What makes you larger doesn't really fill me with confidence. In fact, I would... Oh shit, there's a... Fudge. Luckily, I'm completely outside of my control or intent. <laughs> Our um, orbital dealt with those for us. Yeah, 10 fucking bombs. No worries. Is the wafer somehow relevant to 4th of July Independence Month? Interdependence Day? We'll be celebrating our own Independence Day soon, which is when we commiserate the fact. Less probably the uh, strongest cabal of countries that has ever existed on planet Earth. But I say celebrate. Shit. <laughs> this is hard. He's born next to a bomb that already exists. And stop exploding me with my own bombs. Should we try and do this mini boss? I think no. But we should try and find another coin. Or a spirit heart, like a tinted rock. Tinted rock would be very good right now. Yeah, um, slightly uh, drinking. I uh, beat my word properly. I'm going to assume that that is not a super secret room over there, because if it were, we would have found it. Uh, lots of red hearts. Wrong colour. Thanks for trying. There we go. A black heart in here would be splendid. <laughs> there is an eternal heart. I kind of like um, a Polaroid. It does confuse enemies on a semi-regular basis. And further to that... Um, it's not Liberty Cat. <laughs> Judgment. What have you got for Judgment. Me? We'll come back to that. Now we need to beat this boss, which is a double monster. Quick, whilst everything's confused. Oh god. Ah, it's very difficult. There's very little chance of beating this boss without taking damage because of the amount of screen space that it controls already. Combined with the fact that I keep controlling screen space myself. Which is very unfortunate because I didn't take that much damage to actually kill him. Uh, but, okay. We'll take... This. We might as well play this Joker then. Why are there two batteries in here? Okay. Let's just uh, try not to actually die from this if we can avoid it. So we should stop there because it was good. Ooh, very good timing. The Hierophant. That's exactly what we needed. We should have done that beforehand. Quite obviously because it gave us five shieldy hearts. I don't know. Obviously no deal with the devil because we did take damage on the boss, but now we just need to make it to this boss and not take horrible damage on the way. 
I mean, the one thing about uh, Dr. Fetus here is that it at least gives us the opportunity to get through rooms that would otherwise be massive pains in the arm. Like, exactly this one. But we have to be super careful not to accidentally, you know, wallop ourselves with our own burn. The scatter bombs, well, when every bomb is a scatter bomb, you quickly get used to it. Uh, don't, don't get me wrong there. Oh, yeah, sure, let's take even more fucking bombs. You know what? It's a daily, we're having fun. Deal with it. We'll play properly on the, uh, on the, on the series, when we're trying to get our, uh, 1,001%. For now, it's the 4th of July, we're going to celebrate by drinking beer, which I can. I can see forever, it's really good. Puberty is... Puberty. <laughs> Just take everything. Does this do a thing? It doesn't do a thing. Secret room, no. We know where the secret rooms are, we don't need to worry about that. There's one there. Shit me. We just take everything that could be terribly bad for us, and we let it um, ruin our lives. No problem. Can you please blow that up? Thank you. Obviously, I was hoping for some money, which is what we got. We got split shot. What does this do? Oh, great. <laughs> it does actually work, and it terrifies me. It actually literally is making me poop my little panties right now. Um, I said literally in a hyperbolic way. It's literally the best use of that word. So, now I'm extremely scared by everything that I've done to myself. We might as well go to the shop, see if we can buy something. Yeah, we'll take Humbling Boondle. It gives us two red hearts here, which is massive overkill. I took them both because I'm not going to come back this way because I can't remember where it is. Um, This is scary. We go like this and hope for the best. Yes. Yes. Oh, the little bombs don't actually do as much damage as the big bombs. Oh, fudge. Help me. <laughs> I mean, I didn't say fudge. Look. I took... We take these items, not because they are easy, but because we don't know what happens if you take split shot fucking Dr. Fetus scatter bombs. <laughs> and now we do, so we're learning. Okay? We're all learning. Life is learn. Life is pain. Dizzy for Isaac. Jesus Christ. Somehow, I managed to correctly use my orbital intentionally to deal with that enemy. I do like it when um, Faded Polaroid turns invisible because all the enemies get confused and stop chasing me, and that's exactly what I want them to do. We've actually managed to not take damage for quite a long time right now. Which shocks and appalls me, he says, and music takes damage. There's not a lot of can do. Great. About scatter bombs that trap us in a corner. They are random. May I remind you? Stain, of course. It's always a stain on this fucking floor that I hate. Please. Oh god. How am I alive? Not even alive. How am I not been hit? Ah, oh, you wanker. Okay, fine. Speed up, size down. I do like a speed upgrade. Uh, okay. Our first deal with the devil is El Cramperino. And he walks straight into the laser beam and trolls himself with a billion troll bombs. We don't have a spacebar, right? So we might as well take one. How am I not taking damage from these explosions? I mean, they are smaller explosions, right? Uh, one makes you larger. Not really what I want. We've taken the item. We've been to the shop. We've got Krampus, which means we don't have to fire once every six rooms, which is extremely useful, in my opinion. Oh, now we can see where we're going. We might as well take this. As Samson, we should probably take... Oh, shit. Or not. <laughs> I'm a bit scared now. These are all going to be scatter troll bombs. Yeah. Plenty of cash, though. Oh, pick up it. That troll bomb was not a scatter troll bomb, no. So I was thinking, you know, play the blood bank, get some damage. And also, maybe it would let us into the uh, boss track room there. Because then we'd have enough or low enough HP to be allowed in. No such luck. Well, Fate's Reward is here, so if you can get a hang card, you can at least pick up an item. Don't know if it's the most useful item. Oh yeah, let's take damage. What's the worst that could fucking happen right now? We could put us in the tower ourselves. Hi. Where do we go? I assume that this is not safe. No. Very well. The bomb's here, no? 
kind of expecting the curse room to have left a bomb and just knocked around. That was really good. I'm a fan of that. The hermit. Get out of the room. I'm kind of too scared to do boss rush. Maybe we can scum that up. I mean, we leave so much explosion on the ground on a regular basis that it's difficult to imagine that we're not going to be just able to hit everything all the time unless this sort of shit happens. How are you not? Just use your orbital. <laughs> Actually, oh, okay, apparently I blew up the door and then walked through it. Please. Fudge! <laughs> this is really hard. I keep taking up all the space that I need in order to not do the things that I'm doing. I want you to, um, yeah, that's what I want. Can we do this? Oh, don't do that. Help. Not a, not a good idea. Yeah, bombs. Perfect. Do you know what I just low on? Fucking bombs. That's what Krampus does for you, you see. Krampus is like the equivalent of... I think Krampus just basically is the one that gives you coal in your stocking. Hence lump of coal. So basically I feel like um, Krampus is... Even though I've beaten Krampus, Krampus has shown up for this particular Christmas party. Uh no. Right. <laughs> Scared. <laughs> this is just so shit. Why did you rotate? I needed you to not do that. Specifically what you must not be doing right now. Oh, thank you for uh, confusing the enemy just at the right moment. Of course I've controlled my own space. Fuck. Taking damage. A little bit of speed might actually help. <laughs> I don't really know. This is crazy. If we make it anywhere through this, I'm going to be outstanded. Out what? We should do this. I mean, why not have another curse that does stuff when we get hit, right? I don't know if it's a good idea. Just fill the room with bombs. Do you know what? If they're any, if they're nice to us, which they're not. If you survive long enough, you will get host hat or pyromaniac. True fucking story. Oh, we found a secret. God. Get over there. So basically, we need to make sure that our bombs are on the other side of the room when they explode. Easier said than done. It makes you larger. I don't want to be larger. Um. Fine. Excuse me. So. Maybe we should just be shooting less. I mean, I am shooting fairly often, which is not necessarily a good idea. If you uh, come to that conclusion or not independently. Shit. Help. I may not have done too well just now. I think Cursed Dice just re-roll stuff when you get hit. This is great if there's stuff to re-roll, I suppose. How do you even fight this room? Being able to run away from a bomb when it gets near you is kind of useful, but also you have to sort of notice it. And there has to be room to run. We should be using our orbital more often. The small bombs are not too bad. The small bombs are avoidable at least to some extent. I mean, I've, I've not, not done myself any favours. So let's put it this way. Go to the curse room and get our way out again. Come on. There we go. Uh, what should we do here? Should we somehow explode this? Oh yeah, more fucking bombs. Well, there's Bob's right here. We might as well take it, see if we can get the Bob transformation for whatever that's worth. Oh shit. Try to shoot over the uh, the gap, but of course I couldn't shoot over the gap because there's a rock in my face. Might as well go into the secret room. No, the item room. Uh, it could be really useful. But I'm not going to take it. If you're wondering, if you're wondering what that item does, it allows you to spend money to do damage to everything on the ground on the room. Do you have a certain. Uh, these fucking bombs with their chain reaction. We do have a certain amount of money. So we're not. We're not poor financially. That's the truth, man. Stop fucking jumping. 
whatever. Uh, so we could take it and try and do all the damage in the world. Somehow. But we'd run out of money quickly. I think that's going to be the problem there. We do have Humbling Bundle. Maybe it's best spent on things like Mom's Key and a Spirit Heart and an actual heart. And we should explode this to see. Leave me alone! Saving Kramps' head for the boss, but maybe I shouldn't be. I'm trying to hit it with both fucking sets of bombs right here. Like, all of them, if possible. But it's getting to the point where I'm just using my orbitals is the safest bet. Excellent. Got plenty of battery charges knocking around, so I should really be using Kramps' head way more often than I am. This is not a secret. Really. It is a secret room. All those explosions in completely the wrong place. We should come back for that. I think I forgot one, didn't I? You're probably shouting at me all day. Fuck. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm fast enough that I can, you know, dodge out the way of shit. But only if I see the stuff to dodge out the way of. And most of the time, it's random bombs of my own. Do this when he does that. Yeah. And it's obviously standing still for a while. You can shoot it with your cramps' head. Salvo. Fuck. Oh, i hit. Oh, shit. This is bad. Kill the devil. Kill the devil. You deserve it. You wanker. Do I deserve it? No. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> Give me this. What are we on here? Depths one? Yeah. I'm just going to leave. I think this is one of those situations where the more rooms you can do without dying, the better you're going to be. I honestly... I do hope that the amount of... You know, the amount I put into this, basically, rewards me to some extent. Fudge. You know, because... But... <laughs> I'd like to think that other people are also playing this and doing really badly. Excuse me, what happened to my speed? Let's have a, a quick... What the fuck? Help. Leave. <laughs> Ow! Fuck. <laughs> Don't know what to do. Grab this shit up. Thank you for rotating. For once, that's what I wanted you to do. Uh, ah! They're everywhere! No, everyone else wasn't that stupid. <laughs> Happy 4th of July, you bastards!